And John, I want to ask you a question. Of course, on Good Times Live, you're working with your son, a Grammy nominated music video hey, director. Hey, what's that? Let me and jump in here. Casey, are you there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm right here, Blenda. Both of you, what is it like, starting with you, John, what is it like working with your son on this project? Well, to see him grow into a grown man from a little kid who had aspirations of being on a film set. I mean, he, from, from the time he was old enough to realize what was going on, he wanted to be part of it. But I kept telling him, you better go back to school, boy. So he went back to school, <laughs> got his degree, got his, got his bachelor's, got his master's in live action film. He's been nominated at independent film award shows. I mean, he did more than I ever hoped or thought he could possibly do. I mean, he continues to uh, surprise and to please me, but mostly to surprise, I think those who's who have observed his career from grade school, he's a he's a he's a he's a filmmaker. There's no doubt about it, and he's a damn good filmmaker, as test, as as confirmed by the awards he's received and the recognition he's received as a graduate of Cal Arts. So I'm proud of him, and I look forward to working with him. We've got a number of projects that we're working on now that I hope is is God's will will come to fruition because it'll be a further testimony as to his ability and the, the, the incredible blessing that comes from working with your own child. Oh, that is so wonderful. And Casey, how does it feel working with your father and also being a producer, executive producer on this project as well? Well, there's no questions that he, he leaves a, a major imprint, you know, so it's, it's, some, it's some big shoes to fill. But he's always inspired me. He's always been supportive since day one. He used to come pick me up to go to Roots, you know, and, and he used to wake wow. me up. He used to wake me up about four in the morning before the sun came up to go to Roots. And one day, one morning, I had my lip poked out. He said, you poke your lip out any farther, son, you're going to trip over it. And <laughs> the, re the reason why I was upset because I knew they were going to send me over to the sandbox to play with the youngins, you know, and I wanted to get my opportunity to uh, play make believe with pops, you know, and and now yeah. and now the sky's the limit. And I also want to thank all of the young men that have came up to me over the years and said, "Your father is my father." It gave me a sense of pride, and uh, it always it always let me realize that he was involved in make making people's lives a little bit better. And that's that's just the kind of family I come from, and it, and it feels good to to come from something that that inspires the country. Mm. Oh, this is so, and I wanted to say this, you know, um, going back to Good Times Live and the whole, the whole image um, and the, the, the feeling that comes from watching a show like that, uh, it brings to mind of the strong presence of a, of a strong family, um, and fathers, sons, moms and daughters, everyone combined, and you know, it translates because you two as father and son are now working together in this incredible project that once again is shedding a beautiful light to everyone and giving us all an opportunity to smile and an opportunity to laugh and an opportunity to get to know you, uh, which is so wonderful. And you just, you're just great, the both of you are. Well, thank you, Belinda. We appreciate it. And thank you so much for this opportunity today. Uh, we, th we thank you and I look forward to continuing the relationship and growing as, as momentum builds with the uh, Good Times Live event. Amen.